Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? I'm sorry. I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. Yeah, if you were trying to scare me, fat chance, Kleidos. Anyway. Welcome everyone for Let's Play Portal 2 again. Now we're going into a very unique chamber because this is the only test chamber that has the companion cube. So let's pick it up and... Oh, did I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete the test? I'm sorry. Go ahead and grab another one. And Alright, just wait for it to come down and gotcha! Alright, now there, there's another easter egg in here. As soon as we put the companion cube through the laser, we're gonna head over to the wall there. No, I fizzled that one too. Oh well, we have warehouses full of the things. Absolutely worthless. I'm happy to get rid of them. Yep, we got Wheatley again. How about that? And alright, for real this time, let's put the cube through the laser. Grab Wheatley. And up we go. Uh... Portal here, portal there, and up we go. Alright, I'll set you right here for now, Wheatley. And Companion Cube, come on, uh, up. Alright, now let's grab Wheatley and head to the exit. Are you serious? Stop it! There we go. Now, let's uh, go over here this time. Get more lined up. There we go. There we go. Uh-oh, you're stranded. Let's see if the cube will try to help you escape. Actually, so that we're not here all day, I'll just cut to the chase. It won't. Any feelings you think it has for you are simply byproducts of your sad, empty life. Anyway, here's a new cube for you to project your deranged loneliness onto. Why would that one be destroyed when I could have just gotten that one and head to the exit? Because look, the Emancipation Grill is broken. Every test chamber is equipped with an Emancipation Grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Don't take anything with you. Okay, reverse psychology. I will take something. Let's just roll Wheatley out of here for just a moment. Good. Now, set up a portal here. And let's go back for the companion cube. Alright. And through we go. I think that one was about to say, I love you. And they are sentient, of course. We just have a lot of them. How sad. Didn't even get a chance to say that they loved me. But luckily we still have Wheatley. And no, he won't join us for the next test chamber. It's just another Easter egg glitch. You see? He's not here. This next test involves emancipation grills. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area that did not have one. And alright, to do this test chamber... Just gotta pop a portal over here. Wait, what's that? 
Oh no. The turbines again. I have to go. Wait, this next test does require some explanation. Let me give you the fast version. There. If you have any questions, just remember what I said in slow motion. Test on your own recognizance. I'll be right back. Yeah, super slow motion. I could barely make out any word. Alright, as I was about to say before GLaDOS had her interruption with the turbines, we want to pop a portal here, and over here. Yeah, we're not going through the Emancipation Wheel. That's going to dispense a cube over there, which we'll just go back through. Pick up the cube and go back towards the laser. And ta-da! Test chamber done. We didn't even go through the Emancipation Wheel. Well, we gotta go through this one anyway. And alright. That concludes Chapter 2 of Let's Play Portal 2. I'll see you all next time for Part 3. See you next time.